That's my holy shit. That one was hot. Oh boy. That's like eight Whoa. Oh my god, that like his nostrils on fire. I don't know why. Did a little piece go up there or something? <laughs> Welcome to the hot seat. I'm your host, Kyle Byrne. We're on location at Winging It Hebron Way. This show was brought to you by Rock Solid Gaming, and our sponsors are Kitty Vitty Brewery, Rocketeer Treats, and Winging It. So our guest here today, he was here last season, season one. He's BB Can 11's house guest that everybody loved across Canada, Jonathan. What's up, my man? Good to be here. Good to be back. Yeah. Sometimes I'm wondering why I'm back because I don't know why you're back. Yeah. No, I'm, <laughs> I'm welcome back for a great company, man. Yeah, like, First you said, I don't think I'm gonna come back here. I'm not gonna make it through this. And then you said, uh, Yeah, I'll come back if you ask me to come back. Yeah. I heard you say total it. tough guy here, right? Yeah. Like, you know what I mean? When you woke up in the morning, it was nothing to it. Yeah, it was was really, nothing to this. really yeah. easy. Yeah. So once again, you know the role. It goes to ten wings. Going from mild to NFOD, that's yeah. winging it, burn your mouth off. We get the same one. Oh, yeah. But the other ones are all local. Well, kind of Love local. It. All Atlantic Canada local. Nice. So we got, uh, well, we got our winging it here, and we got Newfoundland, we got New Brunswick. Well, Newfoundland's from Pasadena, actually. Oh, um, and uh, tell your mother. Tell your mother. Tell your mother. Yeah, no, you're going to okay. be fucking screeching. <laughs> and uh, yeah, so they're all. Beauties, local. man, beauties. I mean, like, how friendly is this? Yeah, that's that great. That just screams like a good time to me. Yeah. I can't wait. I'm so they actually, excited. I think they added in more extracts, so it's going to be hotter this time. Yeah. Yeah, so it's going to be really fun. I can't <laughs> wait. Yeah. <laughs> Looking forward to How'd it. How'd you find it last time? In the uh, end. In the end? Yeah. Ooh, let's go down memory lane here. Uh, great. It was a good time. Yeah. yeah it <laughs> was delicious. Fun. <laughs> it was good. fun. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Let's uh, dive in and... Uh, Make some more good memories. Yeah, I don't even find it bad. I, I even wear underwear that says hot sauce on it. Oh yeah, yeah, nice. Yeah, yeah. see, so look. <laughs> oh, oh beauties, you do. Oh, do. Burn up, ladies and gentlemen. Not lying, not yeah. lying about the underwear. No. Yeah, mom bottom for me. Nice. Yeah, bless <laughs> <laughs> for me. That's, yeah. that's just tops it off right there. Yeah, go on, mom. Look at it. Uh, I guess we could just dive in the first wing. It's uh, Roger Victor. It's Roger a, Victor. is a wing in it one. Nice. See? Very pretty. Yeah. And uh, yeah. Let's dig in. I think they got chili sauce on it. This yeah, or does, chili yeah. spice there. A little bit of chili spice. Yeah. Are you going down the wing? Mm-hmm. Oh, man. I see the chili spice is going to be hotter than the sauce. <laughs> God damn, that's good. Yeah, that's pretty good. Mm. That's a lot better with chili. Watch how things change as we get further down. <laughs> mm. Let's do it. Very easy. All right, so delish. What happened? Anything new happening in the past year? Because you're about a year out of the house now. Uh, dude, uh, this year's been wild. That's it. It's been crazy. Uh, been really blessed this past year. A lot has happened since the show. Uh, had the freedom to kind of like, you know, uh, try a few different things. Uh, so it's really been like open-minded about everything, really like uh, chasing some more dreams, like really trying to put my best foot forward and taking advantage of like the the platform that Big Brother gave me. Uh, well, but uh, <laughs> it's a first ring, man. It's good. But uh, yeah, no, man, it's, it's been a crazy year. It's, uh, you know, trying to, there's no secret that I've been trying to get into the acting world and the acting scene. And I've been very blessed and been blessed with a few opportunities and uh, Few projects in the works, and uh, yeah, just trying to trying to take advantage of the whole experience, right? But uh, it's crazy to think that a year has gone by mm. since I've been on the show. Not even it's pretty close. Pretty close, yeah. A month or two. Getting there, pretty close to a year. Uh, it's, it's pretty cool, man. It's uh, it's pretty surreal to watch the season twelve house guests go in there because, like, it honestly feels like yesterday since I've been in that house. So it's pretty cool, but uh, at the same time, it's. Uh, I mean, I said this last year. I mean, it's, it's experience you'll never forget, right? So it's one that'll, one that'll stay with me for the rest of my life. And uh, just seeing other contestants, and other cast members go into the house, it's it's a pretty cool feeling to watch because you know, you know what they're in for and what kind of experience they're going to have. Is like uh, I'm looking forward to talking to some of them as they come out of the house and just see how they felt about the whole oh, thing. they're all going to hit you up. Oh, oh yeah, I hope that. so. Yeah. I hope so, yeah, yeah. So it's it's a, a lot of it. Yeah, so it's, it's pretty cool, man. It's pretty, and this, 
And the coolest thing about this year, I said it in the house, I planned on having another baby. And, mm. and I, I said when I won, I was going to have another baby. I didn't win, but I won Canada's favorite. So I stayed true to my word, and now I'm having a little girl. Perfect. I know, I'm pretty excited, man. So you want all that money, and it's going right to that little girl's going room? Going right to the little girl, man. Yeah. I'm, uh, I was, Pay for uh, diapers. Yeah, paying for diapers, bro. <laughs> I, was, I walked down to aisle in Walmart, or I walked down to aisle in store, and I was just like, I looked at the price of these things, and I was just like, wow. Yeah. yeah. I'm in for it. Oh, yeah. for it. It's going to be great. <laughs> totally worth it, though. Yeah. Totally worth it. Mm. All right, we'll get into the next wing now. Mm. Next wing is a new flan. It's a screeching hot sauce mm. made in Pasadena. It's actually not too bad. It's, it's more like a chili yeah. thing. You look very nervous. Me? Yeah. I'm, I'm actually pretty excited about this one. It looks pretty good. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Is uh, Local's always nice. Local's always nice, man. I love local. Support local. Yeah. Newfoundland local. strong, yeah. yeah. Oh, man. Mm-hmm. Got almost like a sweet kick to it. We're going to toss better sauce than you. You don't know how to toss. Well... <laughs> <laughs> Brutal. Oh my god. That's really that good. good. Mm. Love so, it. So, for anyone who wants to get on uh, Big Brother, what did you do for your audition tape? Like, is your audition tape online? No, I've had a couple of people reach out for it, but I've been reluctant to let it go. I don't want to understand that. Yeah. Honestly, man, when I, uh, when I auditioned for Big Brother, it was like a spur of the moment kind of thing. I just after losing my mom, God rest her soul, God love her. Uh, she was a huge fan of Big Brother, and Big Brother US, Big Brother Canada, like all of them. And I used to watch them with her, like when I lived home. And uh, she always like believed in me to be on TV. She always said I belonged on television. Yeah. And I was like, go on, mom, go on. You know how it is, right? My mom says I'm handsome kind of thing, right? Mine but, old. <laughs> 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 so, must, be, must be nice. <laughs> yeah, mine. <laughs> but yeah, man, when, and when she passed, I was just like, I was sat down in my living room with the dog and I had the laptop there. And I was just, I kept thinking, I kept hearing this thing in my head. Just kept, like, you know, something came over me. I was like, you know what? I'm going to audition. So I went into online, Big Brother Canada website and seen where you auditioned to. And I was like, you know what? I think I did like one video or two. And I was just like, you know what? Sent it in. And I was like, ah, oh, probably never get a call back for this. And I did. Like two days later, I got a call back. And, uh, and What'd you do? Just lie on the couch and. Selfie stick up like I that. I did, bro. Like I, I laid it on the table. Your dog? I went in the living room. My dog came in. I pulled. I put his bed right next to my chair, and I put the laptop in front of me, and I just went like this, and I literally just was myself, dude. Like I never, like I never fabricated nothing. I never. Wow. I was just honest, and uh, it worked out in my favor. So you figure you had to have something to explode to make them catch their eye. Yeah. Thinking, how many tapes did he get? Ten thousand, twenty thousand tapes. I know, bro. Like right. so, and that's what I tell like. Uh, Anyone that goes on the show, like if you get evicted first, last, middle, halfway through, whatever, like money's money, the win's a win, but at the same time, like you were blessed with an opportunity and picked out of thousands and thousands of people mm -hmm. to live out this dream. So like, honestly, dude, like I say it again, like I'm a broken record. I, I feel like I won just participating in the whole thing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I was thinking about uh, auditioning for this year for oh. BB Can 12, yeah. but I get a baby on the way also. So put it down, but I was like, yeah. I'm not going now. I was thinking about next year, mm -hmm. addition to Big Brother. But like, 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 and to do it, like, man, and that's why I tell so many people is like, and if you don't try, how do you know? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, what is it like? The difference between the person you are and the, and the person you want to be is the things you do. So if you don't do those things, you're always going to stay that person and wonder if you could be that one. Yeah. So like, you know, you got to put things in place, and like, dude, we all fall. We all fall down. Yeah. Everyone, everyone's scared. But like, dude, I've failed. Since I've been on that show, I must have sent out hundreds of auditions and got half callbacks and never got the, like, you know what I mean? Never got the one I wanted. But, yeah. like, I put my ring in the hat, and I'm going to keep putting my ring in the hat. So. Yeah, 100%. Yeah, my hat and the ring, sorry. My hat and the ring, yeah. That's the wing stocking. <laughs> yeah, that's the spiciness. <laughs> so we're going to dip in these Rocketeer treats. I'll show everybody now. Uh, we're sponsored by Rocketeer. Uh, it's a freeze-dried candy. They got tons and tons of different kinds. Yeah. Bunch of fruits. Uh, like we got the Pluto Pops or Charleston Chews, and then we got Meteors, they're uh, Skittles. They got sour Skittles too, they're my favorite. I tell mm -hmm. everyone that. Celestial Spheres, the saltwater taffy, and we got Pluto Pops chocolate. Mainly the reason I get you to eat these because I want the next wing to be hot again. Yeah. Right? I that's just right. want you to keep being annoyed by the hotness. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want you to be used to it, right? Yeah, that's right, yeah. yeah. 
But I'm gonna have the Skittle because they're my favorite, obviously. Well, guys, I just tried these things and they're amazing. No joke. I'm gonna have a couple more. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. Take two of that stuff together. Uh, <laughs> that was all I bought. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not even getting water from myself. I'm gonna fill that up right now. Oh my god. It's so good. Amazing. Is that your first time having the Charleston chew? I have my first time having Charleston chew. Definitely yeah. worth it. It's got like that crunch you, with their socks. You don't like, need to eat as much. Mm. It will just satisfy yeah. just as much as a handful. If you get a bag of skills, you're eating a full bag. You're eating a full bag. Those, I don't really eat a full bag. Yeah. I don't need them. Yeah, it's like, and it gives you just like a fluffy, crunchy, I don't know, I love them. They're delicious. Mm. <laughs> yeah. Hats off. It's excellent. All right, we're going to get the next one now. The next mm. one is a kamikaze, also winging it. Nice. Uh, we don't get a Scoville unit on these because they're more of a local. They don't, they never really came out with a Scoville. Yeah. But they're all just hot. They're all just hot. All right. Mm. All right, let's get into this Let's one. Let's in. Yeah. Honestly, bro, like, I love wings. <laughs> so what? Yeah. Like, come on. Like, it's, it's just like, I've been eating these things since what? I've been like eight years old. Yeah. And like, the love has just only gotten stronger. Like, yeah. Mm. I find it. Pretty good. Mm. Yeah. I'm um, actually, I probably should stop eating them. Got a long, long way to go. Long way. <laughs> That's the best part. <laughs> yeah. Mm. So, delicious. You put Newfoundland and Fisherman so far behind on your like one of your first episodes. You know that, right? Mm -hmm. Your first episode, yeah. your competition was on time and not. <laughs> and you what? came last place. Shh, forgot about that. <laughs> you came last place. I did, man. When we seen that happen, we all just okay. died. I'm going to take this moment to explain myself because I feel all like right. I should. Fisherman can't untie and not. Yeah. All right. Okay. <laughs> Here, uh, well, first off, when that competition started, A, I was hungry. I damn like a two bananas before that thing. I was like, man, I'm shaking, I'm hungry, and really nervous, so I just damn like two bananas. And I didn't know anybody. Super shy, super nervous. And uh, yeah, I went into that competition, and like when you were explaining the rules, totally didn't pay attention. I was just like, this is all about whoa, I'm my big brother. You know, so, and totally zoned out. And then like, yeah, we got there, and I, and I was like, I was like, working my way up to the knot, started on doing the knot, and I looked over, Daniel C. was right next to me, and this guy was a beast. He was like running, he was blowing through the knots, and I was like, holy shit, I need to step my game up. <laughs> shit, this is harder than it looks, like, you know what I mean? So, yeah, I, I, well, we got through it, me and Claudia got through it, and we didn't come dead last, which was crazy. I was dead last. Yeah, I'm dead, like, dead last. No, uh, uh, oh, so was you. Um, Pretty close. I think it was Shania and Renee. I uh, Shania deserves it. Yeah. <laughs> dude, and I, no, honestly, like, dude, like, Shania, we still, like, we still keep in touch. Like, she's wicked, right? Yeah. Awesome girl, man. Oh, yeah. Awesome. When I started, like, the house and stuff, she's a wicked chick, man. Like, and that's another thing about being a year out from the show. Mm. I just miss everybody. Like, dude, like, I really do. I, like, I keep in contact with my, with everybody as much as I can. And, like, Rob, he's like a brother to me. Hope is like a brother to me. So we're in contact all the time. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, dude, I miss everybody. For I'd sure. say. Mm. I went up to Toronto twice this summer. I went mm. up uh, August and I went up September. Every time I went up, I seen yeah. Shanae and Dan. Really? Yeah, I never went up to them because I was like, oh, I ain't going to bother with that. Yeah. And uh, literally, the way they are, like on TV, that's yeah. the way they are. They're out in public. I bought a CN Tower, like skipping across the oh, road. Oh, yeah. yeah. Then yeah. I see them in the mall, same thing. They're like skipping and happy the whole time. Dude, two peas in the pod right there. Yeah. They're like so. I, when you see people together and they just have like loads of fun together, that's two of them. Like, 100%. Yeah, oh, yeah, for sure. They got them on Instagram too, and they like sit around playing the Tempo 64. Oh, dude. Like, like, yeah. This is amazing. That's who they are when the cameras are off, too. Like, it's yeah. just, yeah, it's cool. Yeah. That's good. <laughs> All right, we get the next one now. Next Do one it. is uh, from New Brunswick, right? I think they're all New Brunswick, these guys. Not Nova Scotia. I guess all mixed up. Mm. It's a maritime one. Maritime. Yeah. Our oh brother. God. PEI. PEI. What oh, was that? Claudia's land. Oh, that's PEI. I thought it was the New Brunswick. Oh, that's Smoking John's. Yeah. My bad. Yeah. All right. Either way. They got three hot sauces. They gave us three hot sauces. They gave us this one, this one, and this one. This one is a mm. fire candy. It do taste like candy. Oh, it won't really? burn your mouth. Yeah. Uh, it won't burn my eyes. I'm having trouble believing you on that one. Yeah, me too. <laughs> I can see fire, like, fire candy. Yeah, yeah. yeah me too. Mm -hmm. All right, so we're getting this one now. Oh, yeah, let's do it. 
Yeah, so yeah, they got all hot sauces. They gave us a load, they gave us like 12. Oh yeah? Yeah, nice. we just picked these out of it. Yeah. Let's go. Oh man. I know it's supposed to be hot, but it was hot. Your flavor oh, goes on. Delicious. Last season just had a jalapeno that had a good flavor. Yeah? Yeah. Nice, sweet. All right, let's talk about... Um, okay, pick it in a little bit. Good stuff. I know you're a taken man. <laughs> Yo, I know yeah. that. <laughs> Handsome. Taken. Oh, thank you, brother. Yeah. Sound like my mom. <laughs> <laughs> you're welcome. <laughs> Both. You're a man crush for Roberto. Oh, yeah. Man. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> the bromance, yeah. Bromance, yeah. Mm, yeah. Big time. I loved it. Dude, like, honestly, with Rob, it was almost on impact. Like, as soon as we shook each other's hands, we just kind of, like, had that chemistry. Yeah. A lot like me and yourself. When we met in that gym that day. Yeah. We just hit it off. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, no, man, we had each other's back from day one, and, like, honestly, like, we were, like, if we don't talk every day, it's every other day. Mm -hmm. We're very supportive with each other, and, like, every time we're together, we can, you know, you know when you're with somebody, like your friend, that you can just literally sit down, hang out with, and next thing you know, four or five hours have gone by. Yeah. And you're just like, wow, man, like, you're, just, you're just enjoying yourself, shooting shit and like just having fun. He's that guy, yeah. like, you know what I mean? We just really get along, a lot in common. We're, we're just the same goals, like same goal oriented. <laughs> and like what you see is what you get, you know? So yeah, yeah, great dude. So I gotta ask you, I'd, um, I heard rumors that you used to wait in bed for <laughs> Roberto. <laughs> And he'd be lotioning himself up, and you'd be in bed just waiting for him. Oh, yeah. <laughs> just waiting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, uh, you, shouldn't, you must be talking to Shanae. No, no I was Shania. not talking to Shanae at all. No, yeah, I true. wasn't. Thanks, Shanae. <laughs> no. Well, uh, yeah, see, we'd be there getting ready for bed. And, I, you know, I'm just hanging out. Uh, and Rob's hanging out, and two of us just chilling in our underwear. Like, you know, two bros would. I love it. I love yeah, it. That's and, and dude, I'll be here like Shanae and Renee in the next bed giggling. We're like, what? What's wrong? And you're like, you two guys. Yeah. yeah. I'm telling you, man, hilarious. you can make a TV show out of two of us, I swear, man. We just we had a good time. We were very comfortable with each other. And like, when you sleep with a, a dude, or you sleep with a guy for, I don't know, a couple weeks, you tend to get really comfortable with each other. Right? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I laughed when I heard that, man. That's fucking, that's funny. Oh, it was a good time, by it. We, yeah. uh, we looked after each other a little in that house and like we had a lot of fun. Yeah. You know, in between the, the tense moments, it was a it was a good time, bro. Yeah. Yeah. Strange never had that on camera. I know, right? Yeah. He lotion up your back or something. <laughs> <laughs> bro, I can't. Yeah. There's a little spot back yeah. there. Yeah. 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 No, Stefan, it's not like this, Steph. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh man, I, was, I told her I was like, if Rob comes to Newfoundland, I'm gonna like add on an addition to the bed and just like you know that's your spot, bro. <laughs> <It's> <laughs> spot, yeah. Yeah. We take turns with him. Yeah, we just take turns with him. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna dip in one of these again now. We're getting into pineapple mango tango. I'm gonna try one of these bad boys. These are delicious. Oh, so good ones. Yeah. Good, wicked. Whole production adventure brings the sour ones. Oh. <laughs> mm. Laughing over because oh, you know. Damn. Oh. So good, ain't they? They're Stupid. wicked. Stupid yep. good. Yep. I gotta get some of those. My wife would like die for those. Mm. Oh, the production would give you lots. Yep. Huge Skittle fan she is. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. I think they just got stocked up on sour. Didn't you? Yeah, very too. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Nice. Nice. They're hard to come by, see? Yeah. All right. Charleston Chews, man. The, the Charleston Carlson Chews. Carlson Chews. <laughs> you didn't know what they were called. <laughs> All right, now we're into pineapple mango tango. It's rock. You ready for that one? That's one a smoker. That's favorites. a New Brunswick one. I don't care who hears this, who knows this, I'm going to say this on the hot seat. I like pineapple on my pizza. All right, we're going to cut. I'm not even. <laughs> Not even, I don't go there. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I never even tried it. <laughs> well, never really? tried it, yeah. Oh, I'm too scared. You're missing it, I'm like. You think? Yeah, it's living. It's living. That's how you get on Big Brother. That's yeah. how you get on Big Brother. You're getting pineapple on pizza. Pineapple on pizza, yeah. <sighs> that was one of the qualifications in my. Uh, it's a checklist. Sorry, the checklist, yeah. yeah. This guy totally going on TV. <laughs> yeah. <So> sweet. <laughs> All right, we're getting to that one now. <laughs> All right, let's do it. Is it? It's got like a sweet pineapple-y mm -hmm. kick to it. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Delicious. Yeah, that's smoking John. Mm. It's New me. Brunswick. Oh, that's oh, cool. Yeah. <laughs> None of these guys. <laughs> so, another thing I heard. Yeah. This one, I think you're going to get right into. 
Yeah. The Flamingo Call. Oh, the Flamingo Call. Yeah. There was a Flamingo okay, Call that never say. made air. Everybody's was different, but see if I can, I haven't done it in a while. And my little girl's room is flamingo themed. Mm. So I got to really break her into Flamingo Call. I was like, <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe I'm doing this. So who did it? Uh, everybody. It was the whole room's thing. Ty even did this thing, man. No. We even had Ty doing the Flamingo Call. Yeah, after that guy left, they're not going to see his <laughs> yeah. name. Yeah. We have caught, we have, honestly, dude, like, as tense as that house got during the day and how, how many people were like at each other's throats or whatever, come bed, that was my favorite time of the house was bedtime. <laughs> Everybody just shut the game off and just kind of like re relaxed and had fun with each other. It was the best. And like we all just lie in our beds and just kind of just kind of enjoy the fact that we're there together. You yeah. know, so it was, excuse me, well, it's, you know, whoo, get pretty hot. But yeah, uh, it was, uh, uh, what was I saying? The Flamingo Call. Even oh, yeah, the Flamingo it. Call, right. Yeah. This what, totally took my attention away that time, but... Yeah, it was great, man. You just hang out, lights off. My mouse burns the shit out of me here now. <laughs> it's good stuff. I'm just gonna yeah, have still like pineapple. Totally not yeah, out go here. pineapple on pizza. That's so good. <laughs> Can't even wait. Pineapple. <laughs> it's delicious. But yeah, you know, man, when the lights went out, it was like everybody's, everybody's great. Like everybody's joy of being there came out too. Hmm. So it was pretty cool, man. And the flamingo car was just like a, a thing to remind us. Fuck, we're in this together. We're doing it. It's fun. Yeah, see, that's that's the fun part. Oh, bro, it was yeah. so fun. Like, I don't know if they did they show any of that on the show. No, the never show it. Nobody even heard missed. about it. Yeah, yeah. I think uh, it'd be yeah, hilarious. You've done some digging. You've done some digging. No, God, no. <laughs> Why would I do that? <laughs> yeah, no, it was fun, man. It yeah, was a blast. Yeah. No, and now your daughter's room, you're putting all flamingo. Oh, dude, uh, my my wife got like uh, was an accent wall. It's like the flamingo wallpapery, and like it's, it's, it's it looks. It's dope, man. Yeah. It looks wicked. I'm so excited. I, every time I open the, the room door now and I see like her, her her crib, the chair there, like the changing table, shit's getting real, bro. And it's it's anyone that knows me knows how fucking valuable. Excuse my language. Excuse my. How yeah, valuable. I never I never fucking cursed once. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Fuck me, right? But anyways, <laughs> it, family is priority number one with me, dude. And it and I mean that like in the sense like my brothers, my my wife. And my friends too. Like I, 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 I fucking die for my family. You know what I mean. Yeah. So that's just the type of person I am. So now that I'm having a little girl, dude, I. I You're gonna go ball. That flow was gone. Yeah. Oh, the flow was probably gone. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> little you girl. God damn. Bro. She gone. <laughs> <laughs> she gone. Yeah. Yeah. You're gonna model with a mustache. Yeah. Right yeah. Now. Oh, bro. I'm dying for a mustache. <laughs> mustache my, and ball. My bro. wife like dies for a mustache too. Oh right? God. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you. Yeah. Steph. Hey, Steph. Hit me up. <laughs> Slides in my DMs. Nice yeah, mustache. A, nice mustache. Yeah. <laughs> a very comfortable chair. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Uh, mm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, I'm going to dive Woo. in one of these again. Are you actually that hot right now? Look at the sweat. Come every on. Every day. All day. Every yeah, day. you're just hot. Yeah. All day, it's not even the wings, bro. man. I'm just hot and sexy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just sweaty I, all day, every day. Yeah. yeah. Mm. Understandable. All right. Did you have them all yet? Oh yeah, I, had them, I tried them all a couple times even before we started Holy shooting. Fuck, they were full. They were full bowls. I think I ate them all. I know. Alright, we're gonna get the next one now. Alright, right. So this one is cojones. You know cojones. Oh yeah. Everybody knows cojones. Yeah. Right? They're on Torbay Road and they're on uh, Water Street. Water Street, yeah. Yep. Yeah. So they gave us a sauce. And uh, yeah, it's actually hotter than I thought it was gonna be. Really? Yeah, that's why it's up there now. Ooh. Yeah. So it starts getting hot now. And this one. This one is going to like, it's going to piss you off. You're really, really, really easing me into it, aren't you? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Like, Warning. Yeah. <laughs> I'm tripped, I'm going to go sneaky ones. I mean, I don't know. It's like, you know they're going to be hot, but like, when you first bite into it, it's just delicious. Yeah. So you're like, oh, yeah. sucking the bones, and next you know, you're like, whoa, yeah. whoa. <laughs> Sweat beating now. Yeah. Oh my god. Get it in ya. It's good though. It is. Yeah. They're all good. Mm -hmm. Like I said, this is much more flavorful than the last one. Yeah. The last it is. So, you said you're friends with uh, Shania, Roberto, Dan, Hope. Are they ever going to come down to Newfoundland or? 
Actually, uh, I'm not sure about everybody, because everybody wants to, but like everyone got like lost life just gets mm. in the way right now. I mean, uh, and uh, I think Rob, <coughs> we were always talking about getting him down. I think he's going to come down for George Street Fest. That's what I was going to say. Yeah, I think he's going to come down for George. He's trying to make it a point to, to plan around George Street Fest. Get so, DJ Dan down. DJ Dan down. Right. Actually, bro, it, we he was looking into doing a show here. It'd be deadly. But uh, it was hard to get. It was hard to line up because of the capital and that, that like these type of music that he plays. It was hard to get like the the spot for it. Yeah, spot for it and stuff. So he's continuously looking into it because that'd be badass. We get a show going down here, yes. right? Yeah. So we teach him how to actually drink. Oh, we're gonna screech right. him in, do all that stuff. Oh. I can't wait. I'm gonna get Rob down here and screech him in. Yes, man. I imagine that there's gonna be. A, Few ladies looking to be a codfish chef that night, so <laughs> yes. <laughs> when hot rod rolls the town, yeah. Oh my god, god man! That. Like his nostrils on fire. I don't know why. Did a little piece go up there or something? Oh yeah. no, that'd be deadly. Get them all down. If they all came down at the same time for George Street Fest, man, that'd be sweet. It'd be yeah, a, it'd be a riot. Oh man, it'd be a lot of fun. Yeah, um, I'd be tagging along in the back. Hey guys, yeah. oh, wait man. for me. You'd be up front and center with us, bro. <laughs> Yeah. yeah. We'll no, get Jay Lack through the screech in. Jay Lack, there you go. Yeah, was it uh, Skipper Dickey? Is that what he goes by? I think it's Skipper Dickey he goes by. Is it? Yeah. Oh, wow. Skipper he Dickey. He, he got his own uh, screeching thing. Does he? Yeah, he was the. Uh, oh, my God. What did it call again? Jay Lack's the man. What's that hat called? Yeah. Southwester hat. Really? He, got, he wears a Southwester hat, a big yellow coat. Yes. How did I never hear this? Yeah. So Dude. we get him down, do the big screeching. Let's do it. Yeah, we'll get one of the camera guys follow us around. You gotta get you guys down here. Jay Lack will screech you in. It'll be a time. Yeah, two times. Hey, bye. It's a full week. There you go. Full yeah. week. Full week. Mm -hmm. All different music, too, man. You got like country night. You got Newfie night. Yeah. Newfie night's the best night. I don't care. If you don't care, like Newfie music, it got the, it's the best time. Dude, makes you wanna drink and have fun. How could it not be good? Exactly. You know what I'm saying? Everybody likes yeah. drinking and having it's, fun. It's like the hardest music to work to. Like, because when you're working and you're listening to Newfie music, you're going, oh, I don't wanna work right now. I wanna drink. I wanna get hammered. I wanna get hammered and have fun and get laugh and. Wake up tomorrow and not remember anything. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> just hate life. Yeah. It's just like eating hot wings. <laughs> You're just out of it. <laughs> Bro, wait, where am I? Yeah. <laughs> Roberto, where'd you get from? Where'd you yeah. come from, Roberto? Uh, Rob, <laughs> why, are you, why are you wearing my pants? <laughs> again. Yeah, again. Again, bro. Yeah. Yeah, no, man, it'd be a fun time. It would. Yeah. Looking man. forward to getting them down and screeching them in. Yeah. yeah. That would definitely be a lot of fun. Yeah. And I thought about that. I was like, yeah, DJ Dan, he. DJs up in Alberta, he DJs He's in a, Ontario. I mean, when I got it, because like one of his songs is actually on the soundtrack of the Fast and Furious movie, right? Like, is it? Oh yeah, you get hooked on one of his songs. Got is on the, the I think the newest one. Mm. Yeah, uh, with Jason Momoa. It got to be the newest one, right? Yeah. I don't know. I've never seen the newest. Yeah, whatever one came out when we came out of the house, because he came out of the house and mm. found out that his song was picked up by Fast and the Furious. So that was a pretty cool thing for oh, him to wow. out to. Yeah. He's a very it, it, like that man, Dan Dan S. Is, he's like. He's a DJ, but he's a crazy good chef. He's just super talented. And he got like a motor that just doesn't run out. You see that guy run? No. Like, man, dude, he just doesn't run out of energy. Right really? There. Yeah, yeah, so. Mm. Mm. Pretty deadly. Yeah. All right, now we're gonna get into the fire candy. Sweet. They got a really good name. That's also the PEI one. Mm -hmm. The Maritime Madness. Right? Or the Maritime ones. Yeah. And yeah, it's, the first bite is sweet. It do taste like candy, but then it do burn you. <laughs> it does get really hot. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I can't yeah. lie to you. You contemplate life. Yeah. All yeah. right. Look at it. Just, just glistening. Yeah, it's just sticky. Yeah. Yeah. Let's do it. First bite's weird. Or 10 bites in a row. That's cool, too. Yeah, I'd rather have done that. Rotisserie. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Boy, that was a pig on a stick. That's <laughs> <Just> chewing. <laughs> Came to play this time. <laughs> yeah. Ain't messing around. That's why I got the mustache. Yeah, I'm getting him. Oh. <laughs> I'm just joking. Just kidding. Totally kidding. Uh. <laughs> what are we doing? Yeah, yeah my hand. <laughs> yeah. So good. Let's not do it. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh my god. It's good, isn't it? It was really good, man. It's delicious. It, that one got a lot of flavor. Yeah. It burns you. Oh, yeah. I wouldn't eat two in a row. Or, look, I just ate it. Was, I gotta keep eating this, go. man. You're done. So, you got, like, any more, like, milk there? Like, tons. I might drink that whole thing now. It's like, we'll see. Yeah. No. Look at your beer, whatever you need. <laughs> nice, isn't it? Yeah. I'm not even gonna touch that. I don't even need that now. Woo! 
Like I said, I got my hot underwear on. I'm good. You were, yeah, you got like yeah. a superpower, didn't you, bro? Really, like, yeah. You got like a like yeah. Superman's cloak on there. Plus two and hot spicy foods. Yeah. <laughs> And that mustache is like dimmer in and off. Yeah, of it, right? so good. Yeah, <laughs> I used to have the handlebar. I didn't like it. I like to have the porn mustache. Yeah, well, you gotta yeah. have like the mustache, mustache. Yeah. yeah. You don't know, like you don't really get girls compliment you. You get guys compliment. Oh yeah, like, yeah. Like, you go bro. around Home Hardware or Home Depot, they love you. Yeah. Guys, yeah. bro. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly what they do. Yeah. <laughs> You're walking around. I was like, bro, nice mustache. Yeah. It's so good. Yeah. yeah. You just gotta have the twisters and be like, just. Yeah. The girls just are scared because they just. Looks like your dad. Yeah. Right? <laughs> or a 70s type of mu- movies that came out once. Yeah. Like adults watch. Yeah. I can't, I can't act in those. They're too small. <laughs> yeah. A few more inches that would have made it. Mm. Yeah. Like six. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Whoa. We gotta get Boy. serious since it's hitting you really good now. Yeah. I gotta get real serious. Have something. What do you want? I'm gonna have one of these bad boys. Only because they're delicious, though. Not because of my <laughs> no, it's not hot at all. Yeah. Uh, do you have any more acting jobs lined up at all? I know. I've seen your Instagram. I've seen a sexy <laughs> fucking security guard. Security guard or correctional officer, wasn't it? Security guard. Security guard. Yeah, yeah. actually. So uh, go ahead, motherfucker. I've got a lot of things in the works, bro. A lot off. of things I'm excited about. I'm actually working a couple projects with a couple friends of mine that I met through the acting world. Mm. Um, nothing really I can talk about, I don't think. But um, a lot of interesting stuff coming to the island. And a lot of interesting, a lot of interesting opportunities off the island. Yeah, it's just a matter of when. But uh, I'm always putting my work in, man. I'm doing my work and uh, I'm working hard. I mean, bro, like if I've learned anything from like the point of COVID to now, you can fucking do it, man. Like you know, you honestly, like I always say, like I think I heard, I can't remember I heard it though, like because like what holds you back from chasing the things you want to do? Fear. Mm-hmm. Everyone's like, oh, I'm not afraid of nothing. I'm not afraid of this. But we're all afraid. But what makes the difference between <clears throat> a coward and a hero is like they share one thing that also differentiates them or makes them different. Mm-hmm. A coward uh, and a hero is a uh, most burned off in here now. <laughs> but is how you manage that fear. You know yeah. what I'm saying? That, that you can move forward with, right? You can either let it like, break you or you can let it make you. Like, you can say, oh, I'm afraid. I'm not going to do that. Or you can say, get in the back seat, buckle up. We're going for a fucking ride. And regardless of what happens, I'm 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 on my way. You know what I mean? I'm chasing. Everybody's afraid to get judged. It's just yeah, you terrified judge. to get judged. Dude, man, I've been ju- like I've done that show, <laughs> and I've been putting my I put myself out there. That's what I do. And uh, I'm not afraid to be judged. But it's, it's all about the person looking back at me in the mirror in the morning, and in the night that I care about. Yeah. Who's judging me? And that's me, because like. Bro, this is my life. I, will, I was born into it, and I'm going to go out with it. So what the fuck I do between the day I was born and the day I die, totally up to me. So I'm going to I'm gonna fucking do it. And it's, uh, you know, nobody or nothing going to stand in my way. I mean, look at it, bro. Like, I'm, I did Big Brother Canada. I was voted Canada's favorite player, which is something I'll fucking wear proudly in my whole life. I'm here talking to you. You know, thank you, thank you, <laughs> thank you. And I'm here talking to you on this fucking badass show at like winging it, eating some of my favorite food, getting mouth burning off me. And I'm, and Twice. I'm, and I'm fucking Twice. super excited about it. Right now, bro, I'm alive. So yeah. if I could tell anybody anything, be afraid, be scared, but grab it, own it, and fucking use it to move forward. Like, 100%. you know what I'm saying? Like, it's, it's just, that's how I live my life. No, that's the way you gotta live it. Yeah, it's the best way to live yeah. it. Yeah, my mom instilled that in me in her last moments, and I swear to fuck, it, it'll stay with me for the rest of my life. That's why you won favorite house guest in Canada, because you. you were yourself. Yeah, you never changed. You never went with that guy. Like I said, I'm not gonna mention his name. I don't wanna mention his name. Yeah, you never went with him and his ego. You left that group. You stuck with Roberto the whole time, and you were the only vote for Roberto too, right? Yeah. You voted for uh, Roberto anyways. There was a few more, uh, but uh, I was upfront about it. Like, yeah, you're I, like, I'm I, doing it anyways. I don't care. And like, yeah, I think I think he was up <clears> against <throat> Renee, and I love Renee. Don't get me wrong, she's my my sister from a different mystery. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But I told her I couldn't lie to her, and that's one thing I didn't do is when people asked me where my vote was going, I was upfront about it. I hauled him aside and talked to him one on one and give him my honest answer. And that's why everybody loves you. And Thank you're you, just Straight up that. with it. Yeah. And that, that comes a lot from my family, the Leonards, you know what I'm saying? The yeah. raw, raw like that. I'm very proud to, I'm for, very proud to be like that, right? And um, on the show, I didn't know how that was going to be reciprocated or how it was going to be, how it 
Canada was going to respond, but then I got Canada's favorite. And that hug I got from my boy in the airport, bro, I was a fucking superhero. I'd say. Mm, yeah, it was cool. 100%. Mm. Was he 13 then? 12, 13? He was 12 then, yeah. And yeah. Uh, I was a superhero, and I, was, I felt like it then. Yeah, it was pretty cool. Yeah. Mm. See? Keep the fraud. Yeah. Be yeah. yourself. Yeah. Mm. All right, let's get in this one now. So this one is number 12. So that was, I think it was like a nine or something to consider this one. So this yep. one is supposedly hotter. And yeah, this is also from PEI. PEI, man. Yeah, they, uh, they hooked us up pretty good. Yeah, Claudia's neck of the woods is the real deal. Yeah. Yeah. You ever talked to her? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah Claudia, oh, uh, occasionally. Like, I mean. She's not with Ty anymore, is she? No, I don't think her and Todd together. Nah, I, no, I, I can't say that for sure. I don't know, but uh, I, I don't think so. Now, I think they're friends. I know they're friends. 100% know they're friends, but I don't know if they're together together, mm -hmm. right? No. All right, let's do it. <laughs> this is a hot one. Am I going to take a second boy? Oh, I am. You're going to take a second boy. I'm dummy in this. Mm. If you don't eat it, I'm eating it off your plate. Mm. <laughs> let's go. <laughs> oh. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I like that Kool-Aid guy busting through the wow. Oh no. Yeah, your same colors. <laughs> <laughs> Am I wearing it? No, oh, yeah. I'm wearing the red. Yeah. You're I'm, nagging everything, man. Is it really? Yeah. Yep. Shit. We could turn down lights, they'll see. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, you think that's a glow from the light behind that? No, that's Jonathan glowing. Uh, that's me. <laughs> that's my holy shit, that one was hot. Oh boy. Eighth one. I got a little brave with that one. Yeah. Oh man, I just got some on my sweater that my wife just bought me. I mean, totally picked it myself. Oh, she'd be a grouchy pants if you got that dirty. Yeah, my wife doesn't dress. That's, that dress is that the maternity one? Huh? Is that the maternity one? <laughs> I don't know, bro. Oh my god. Am I sweating yet? No, God no. I'm not either. <sighs> no, because no. you're you're sweating down in your my underwear. Your underwear. Yeah. Look at it. I'm burning up. You got all like spicy stuff right across the underwear, man. It's nice. I'm not here right now. All right, we're gonna get another question now. Are you ready? I'm ready. <clears throat> you ever think about going on an amazing race at all? I actually it was like another another big dream of mine I wanted to do, and uh, I really wanted to do it this year. Mm -hmm. But my wife. Uh, I really wanted to do it with my wife. Yeah. Probably careful what you wish for on that one, but. But she got pregnant, you know, so it wasn't really going to work out. Yeah. But, uh, and, I, and if I did have to wine with someone else, I wouldn't have been here for, for the birth of my child. So, uh, I mean, never say never, uh, but I'd, I'd always love to be on an amazing race. I mean, think how cool that is. I mean, A, you're doing a challenge. B, you're traveling around Canada, sometimes outside of Canada. Yeah. And it's like, well, this is where my wife would have came in. She's wicked at puzzles. Me, not so much. Yeah, I can tell what you're not. <laughs> Notice how I looked in the camera as he said that. Because I knew it was coming. But, yeah, uh, whew, it wasn't my strong point. But I can bring the morale, man. I'm an energy oh, guy. Honestly. But, uh, yeah, I know it would have been really fun to do it with my wife. And uh, it just would have been something like sharing with someone you love. Uh, would have been a crazy cool experience. I mean, never say never. But, uh yeah, I definitely would be into an amazing race because, like, I mean, it's, I was always a big fan of amazing race. You know? Wow. <laughs> I can't lose my professionalism here. No, this, this is professional, man. This is a serious thing. Professional. Yeah, this is a serious. Don't lose your composure. Fuck! <laughs> 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 oh, boy. Yeah. Oh, man. Yeah, so if your wife can't do it, Hit me up. Yeah. My ACL will be healed, healed next year. Yeah. 100%. I got six months, I'll be healed. Yeah, my Achilles, your ACL will make one good one anyway. Oh, man. What yeah. leg is it? What? what my leg? left. Fuck. That I know. sucks. That's my left. Though. Is it? Yeah. We just hop along. We can't do like shoulder, a shoulder, bro. three leg race. We'll be fucked. Woo! Are you ready? We'll make it work. We're going to go to the ninth one now. This is a Smoking John's again. Ready? Smoking John's, yep. Yeah. This is cranberry. It's easy. It sounds, don't even sound hot. No? Yeah, so we're gonna eat that one now. I believe you. Yeah, it's not even hot, it's cranberry. Mm -hmm. Come on, man. How can okay. cranberries be hot? Let's go, smoking giants. Yeah, <laughs> go to Brunswick. We're gonna go to Brunswick. It's great. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> Yum. Do I go for a second bite? I can't. I mean, that's fine. You don't I have to dip it in the milk or like. No, you don't have to eat it. Everybody's just going to judge you anyways. Yeah. <laughs> judge me right there. <laughs> no, I'm going to eat it. These aren't tears. They're eye sweat. Yeah. My eyes are sweaty. Yeah, I'm crying in your eyes. I'm crying right now. <laughs> me too. I gotta believe in myself here. Yeah. Preach, practice what I preach. <laughs> I know it's one thing. These uh, napkin numbers were like dead on because like this is my second last one. This is my last one. Oh, they're very cheap production here. Oh, they gives you like exact amount. Dude, like you're not even like sweating. Or, like you're a little red, but no. like you know a little insecure here. No, I'm on a plane. I never loved cows so much yeah. before in my life. Mine's barbecue sauce. All right, so our second last question. Um, basically, like, what is your future goals? Are you going to move away? You're going to go to Toronto and the big show? Are uh, you going to go to the States? Uh, or well, are you going to be a new flamboy? One, th one thing I don't know is what the future holds. One thing I do know is I'm going to keep chasing my dreams, and wherever they take me, I don't know. But one thing I can guarantee you, everyone watching and everyone here in production, new flam's my home. I'll always come home. So where I, wherever I'm through in the world, Newfoundland will always be my home. You know what I'm saying? I, I'm, whoa, baby. <laughs> Your lips are... <laughs> I got I to gotta get. I gotta feel what I'm saying right now because mm -hmm. if I don't, I'm going to feel the burn. And Yeah, you're going to disappoint all <laughs> Newfoundlanders again. Yeah. Uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> not Canada. Not Canada. Uh, yeah. Yeah. yeah, no. Uh, yeah, dude. No, man. I'll never leave home permanently or whatever. Wherever I face I can't either. No, man. It's Newfoundland. It's home. No, it's vacation's great. Yeah, vacation's great. Yeah. But like, think about it. Like, wherever you go in the world, when you get, when you hit touchdown, <clears throat> when you get off that plane, you come into our airport. Like, it's just different. Oh, it hits different. It really you know? is. Yeah. Hometown boy. Yeah. yeah. So I'll always be hometown boy. Yeah. Old Newfoundland yeah. boy. Yeah. All right, we're we'll getting to the last wing. Oh my God. What do they got? Jalapenos on us. I may. Is it a jalapeno or a jalapeno? I don't want the owner of Wingda here judging me. All right, man. All right, I'm gonna eat the jalapeno right off the top. Oh, that big one too. Look at that one, dude. All right, right. I'm Thank gonna you. eat the big one too, yeah. everyone. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers. Hey, that's average. Cheers. That's average. <laughs> it's not the size. It's how you use it, okay? <laughs> yeah, it's the okay. We're in Raleigh. Holy shit! Can't even fucking taste it. No, me neither. It just tastes like a fucking green pepper. Let me taste them too, I guess. Really? I'm just yeah. gonna I'm gonna gobble them all down at once. Like, all of them down at once. <laughs> yeah. Come on, man. I, I can get big. They big boy pie. Ready? I'm ah. ready. <coughs> I know this is gonna suck. Holy! <coughs> you don't have any all crept up on you. This one's an impact. Not in bad. Thank you, Wendy, for the delicious wings. You're best. Yeah, mmm. Delicious, really good. Uh, you could have made them hotter. Mm hmm. <laughs> yep. Yeah. This is like cold or something. Yep. Yeah. Oh. I get like the shakes. Yep. Yeah. You were seriously eating more than one bite of that? I'm gonna eat the whole thing. They took our candy away. Damn it. Production's terrible. Yes. <laughs> Here comes our guardian angel with candy. I'm gonna eat the whole thing. Oh, right. I must, I must like touch my face. Touch on. Told you. You're not gonna eat the me. whole thing? Not yet. Dude, so bro, close. Come on. Man. Another competition you can't finish. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> so I came out here expecting to feel the burn. Now I'm feeling hurt. Yeah. <laughs> you feel three burns the spiciness, the burns, and the Kyle burn. <laughs> I know why well, they picked him to host, because he just, he's able to hurt. Yeah. That <laughs> ain't that bad. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers, bro. Oh, man, you're a man of steel. Yeah. I can't. You're beating me. All right, we'll get to the last question then. Oh, yeah, sure. Yeah. Well, that's the most embarrassing thing that happened to you or someone on the show that you think of? Preferably you if you got one. Not anything, anyone on the show? Uh, most embarrassing thing. Holy shit. Can you get your tears out of my eyes, please? Uh, I think he spit in my eyes. Did I? No. Oh, I was gonna say I'm sorry. No. no but the uh, most embarrassing thing, man, was probably I'm sorry, there's a couple of those outfits. 
And not get one thing. I don't know if it was embarrassing, more of a regret. I didn't get to play in a POV. None? No, not one. Oh, uh, even when I got evicted, I was back door. If uh, your mouth burned really bad, breathe in deep. <laughs> <laughs> didn't work, bro. Why do I believe this guy? I trust him so much. Uh, no POV. Oh, you're not going to be able to make it home. You got a long drive. I'll put you in the back of the van. <laughs> Don't mind other people back there. <laughs> I'll fit right in. Mm. But uh, most embarrassing, I don't know, man. Well, besides uh, going in there thinking that I was going to be in shape and then taking my shirt off and then seeing hope. <laughs> I was just like, damn. Yeah. <laughs> that guy like, got like 0.0% fat. But, uh, and you gave up on the hope fitness. Hope, get him back into fitness, man. I was doing good. Then I'll join you. Life happened. I don't got to do leg day now, so I'm good. Oh, bro. All right. Woo. I guess we'll clue it up. Yeah, but it's great. I love that idea. Congratulations. You made it through it. Very yeah. easy. Like, yeah, yo, yeah. yeah. Don't wipe your eyes or you will burn. Well, thank you so much for getting on the show again. I, uh, I want to know what you're like after a year and everything happened thank after you, a year. I'm happy. That's the um, main thing. If there's anything you want to say to the camera, the socials, anything. Hey, guys. Don't come on the show. Yeah. You keep an eye on this show because it's extremely fun to do. I can only imagine it's extremely fun to watch. Uh, support local because that's what, that's what us East Coasters do. We look after each other. And uh, if you want to follow me, keep up with me on Jonathan Leonard Official on social medias. And uh, I'll see you guys. <laughs> see you guys soon. Keep an eye out. More stuff to come. And I uh, hope you enjoyed it because. I certainly did. <laughs> and uh, yeah, guys, it was fun. Thanks. Yeah. Cheers. And special thanks to Winging It on Hebron Way. Um, they did an excellent job here. We're in the party room right now. It's uh, actually really nice to get a TV here, but they turn it off on me because they don't want me to watch TV. But that's fine. That's fine. Ooh. They uh, gave me some spicy wings, and Jonathan's still here crying. Yeah. And uh, you know, besides the hotness of these things, they're delicious. Uh, Thank you, Winging It. Really appreciate having me. And uh, until next time. If you like the video, please like and subscribe to the video because we want to keep making more stuff like this and there's more content coming out. Like the hot seat and we got a lot of things on the horizon, actually. Yep. So, stay tuned. Yes, sir. Let's do it. Boom. See you soon. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! That was good. How was it? Hot. Thanks, buddy. Thanks, brother. I appreciate you having me, man. No problem. I wanted you back on.